All right, here, this is this simple, simple build material. It's fire resistant and it's easy to cut. You can cut it in any shape you want to cut with a handsaw. There you go. You got your blocks. So you can cut it in any shapes um, fairly easy. And you can see on the inside of here, if you get up close, um, it's tiny little air pockets trapped inside here. So it, it will not crack in the in extreme colds. So it, it withstands heat and it'll withstand the, the cold temperatures. If you come over here and look at this, this was built uh, last spring, I got this far before I had to go to work, but um, none of it cracked, none of the joints cracked, and we had about, I think it got below, uh, t it got 10 below zero out here in Indiana. So none of it cracked. Um, so this is, this is an awesome material, and you can see that I can stand on it. You know, it withstands the, we're also going to put a wrap on it. Uh, the, next, the next step in this is, uh, we're gonna put a wrap around it. It's got a tensile strength of uh, 175 pounds. So this is an aircrete dome. I started last uh, fall. Uh, it sat through the winter because I had to go to work, but we're back at it. So this is the compass arm. What it is, is this is gonna give you your radius, or this is gonna give you your whole dimension of the whole dome with one tool. So you set this, this is half the, half the height of a human set it up that way when you can you can access every square every square foot of the uh of the dome because what happens is once you come up and it comes out it'll go right over your head so you don't lose any space inside your dwelling area so and when you're setting the blocks so when you set each block what you do is you come up to it you set it up to the angle and this will be the inside of your dome you'll set it up to the angle and then you grab an angle finder and you'll set it you'll set it down here you'll find the angle and then what you're going to do is you're going to come over here to the saw we got a band saw over here that make all our cuts so what you do is you'll come up here and you'll adjust just your saw i got a little jig made so what you'll do is you'll set this to the right the right uh degree and then you clamp it down for what your block distance is, and then you just start it up and you run your blocks through.